Hello everyone, it's Lewis here. Um, I would like to talk to you about the movie called Rocks. Um, it's a new British movie that's just come out. Um, I think it's available in cinemas, but I saw it was on Netflix and I heard, um, I don't really you know, tend to listen to many reviews or watch many reviews before I see a film, but um, sometimes you hear things and I kind of, if there's enough buzz around something, I kind of go, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll check that out. And I saw it was on Netflix and I thought, I'll give it a look. Um, and yeah, I'm glad I did. I, I thought it would be something I'd, I'd like and I wasn't wrong. It's, um, let me just check the director's name just so I get it right. It is directed by Sarah Gavron, who I looked up earlier. I've not seen any of her work before, but she's um, quite a big champion of women's filmmaking. And I think all of her work is about uh, women and empowering women and that kind of thing. And this film's no exception because it's um, it's basically the story of a young British girl whose mother abandons basically her and us, her and her little brother, and she just has to kind of look after him whilst going to school and kind of whilst you know being a teenage girl in in London basically. Um, and yeah it's really really good um it's quite a simple setup quite a simple story um but i think the strength of it is the characters and the performances um i feel like a lot of these people probably aren't actors and they're as i said i don't know any of them um but um it's i can't see much information about the film online so i'm not sure but i feel like it's one of those things where they kind of they cast people from like the local area or something like that but um, the main the main girl in it in particular is very very good. Um, I think she's fifteen in the film, so I assume she's around that age in real life. Um, I'm not quite sure what her name is, but um, but yeah, I feel like it's the case of they've taken these people and just got them to be themselves basically. So in in some ways and in the way it's shot, it's almost like a documentary kind of thing. Like it's not shot like that, but it does kind of feel like it because it feels very very genuine. And the way these girls talk and the way they act is probably quite realistic to the way you know kids and younger girls act now and that kind of thing. But um, but yeah, it's a, it's a really really good story. Like the girl doesn't want to um, doesn't want to give in and doesn't want to accept help. She's kind of confident that her mum will come back and everything will be back on track and she can look after herself. She can look after her little brother who kind of is just you know he's a little boy. He just kind of takes things as they come. Um, and yeah, it's. Uh, it's it's interesting like the the way the character develops as well like she goes from just kind of going you know I can do I can do this on my own then it kind of things get a little bit more and more out of hand but not in like an overly dramatic way there's no there's nothing really big that happens it's just kind of probably quite realistic I would assume in that situation um, but yeah and the the main the main thing about the main crux of the film is just about friendship really and it's about her and her school friends and um like the beginning of the film it just shows them kind of hanging out and um just being friends as they are and it's it's just her not being able to accept help from her friends but also her friends wanting to help her as well kind of thing and it's 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 a really interesting really well made film like in some of the more dramatic scenes um like the the camera goes quite close in and that kind of again it kind of makes it a little bit kind of almost documentary style but then it's kind of uh quite bold and dramatic in those in those particular scenes as well um but yeah i think if you like kind of serious dramas that have kind of a quite a good bit of heart to them and um if you like like i say uh, british films indie films that kind of thing i think um i think this would be up your street and like i say it's on netflix so you can check it out and it's it's about 90 minutes long which is absolutely perfect it's not there's there's no no what nothing wasted in it. it is all just absolutely perfect length film um but yeah i really liked it i really appreciate it i thought it was very good very well done um so yeah that is my thoughts on the film rocks um check it out if you like it if you've watched it or if you're going to watch it um leave a comment please uh please like and subscribe that's you have to say on youtube um and yeah check back soon hopefully i'll have some more film reviews uh thank you very much